So let me tell you why I'm so excited about using Tiger Nut Meal Lamar fishing. Guys can use it in a stick mix. Conventional anglers even use it in, in a sort of milli bomb. But I do is I make a ground feed and it's got a double benefit. There's absolutely rich flavors from the Tiger Nut. Carp just love it. And then there's an incredible visual aspect to it. So what do you do to prepare it? Unlike having to soak normal tiger nuts and feeding fish for, you can just simply use a little bit of tiger nut meal in a bucket. That's enough. From there, there we go, that's it. I just pour some boiling water on it. There we go, approximately two to three times the amount of water to tiger nut meal. Maybe a little bit more meal. maybe a little bit more water and just mix that right through. Now I love my boilie fishing and for that reason I put a couple of boilies in there right in this hot water. That's going to cause the flavor to infuse in the tiger nut. The tiger nut's going to infuse with the boilies. Boilies are going to be nice and plump and everything's just going to come together in one magic show. So this is it, we've got boiling water in there, you've got the tiger nut meal in there, cover it up and just leave it for 15 minutes. Then we take it from there and you'll see what I mean. Right, there we go, 15 minutes later and what's happened, we've added a little bit of hemp. You can be absolutely creative here, add crushed boilies in there, add a bit of fish meal in there, add whatever you want to add in to enhance your ground bait or your feed. So, what's happened now is that you've got a thick, gooish tiger nut, which means a little goes a long way. You can... Uh, basically see that from a little bit we've made about three times the amount of feed. Now what's nice about this you can see the water around me is extremely murky. We still want to get some visual indication. How are we going to go about doing that? We take this, drop it in the water like a normal bait drop and you'll see what happens. Immediately there's this cloud suspended particles going all the way down, all the way on the top and this becomes such a great visual indicator. We're going to put a little bit more, not a lot necessary, but that's definitely going to give the fish a clue as to where to go and where the food can be found. Put your hook bait right in it, put it behind it, put it in front, and the fish will definitely be able to sort of see and guide its way down. Even if you're feeding at depth, it's a great way to create a feed column because this is going to suspend all the way down into the water. You've got top level, middle level and then all the way to the bottom and that's where, where the pickup is going to happen. So easy peasy, tiger nut meal, great stuff. Let's put another wallop in there and you see what happens. How's that cloud? Unbelievable, so easy to prepare and a fantastic addition to your baiting arsenal.